So today we're playing, uh, again, for the second time we're playing Pokemon XG Next Gen, which is a, a ROM hack, a fan remake of Pokemon XD Gales of Darkness, which I never got to play on GameCube uh, back then. Uh, I don't know. I just... I like Pokemon, I just never got to play it back then. So I get to play it now, but it's a fan made. So what, what they've done is they've updated the uh, entire, uh, I guess, Pokedex uh, to up to Gen 7, uh, which is Sun and Moon and, and whatnot. So I like I'm, I don't know, because I never played the first gen, but I watched a bit of gameplay from the first gen since last I played this. Like it is not at all the same fights, like not at all, at all, at all. And it's kind of cool because I'm getting like Mudkip and like other cool boys that I really like, Trico and whatnot. So here we are. By the way, everyone, I legit found my Bulkasaur shirt. I had I I've I thought I officially lost this shirt for a hundred years. I could never wear it for the first year and a half of streaming because I used only a green screen and it would pick up on my green screen so no one would be able to see it. But this is my favorite of all the Bulkamon shirts. This muscly Bulbasaur flexing the dumbbell moves and he's just so happy. It's such it's so appropriate. And for those that don't know, Bulbasaur is my favorite damn Pokemon. He's a pitbull with a flower on his back. And that being said, let's play a goddamn game. Uh, essentially, Lugia stole a boat. And there's some scientists that want to use Shadow Pokemon for their own good. Whereas uh, Shadow Pokemon, our crew, want to cleanse them of their shadowness. Because they're kind of crazy when they're shadow. This is my sister. She's super annoying. She says her name 25 times a sentence. The there it is. Jovi wishes she could ride too. Will the professor let Jovi go on it if Jovi asks nicely? And that's just the start. So I've set up some Pokemon here in uh, essentially the purifying chamber. Which this has like better graphics than any other game. And this I would imagine is about the same thing as using them in battle. And, but then I could purify multiple at a time. If you bind other normal Pokemon with them, they purify faster. And why are there music notes coming out of their butts? Okay, they're just coming out of the ground. All right. So, uh, no. Let's get out of here. Okay, cool. So we've now unlocked this pure... The music notes is the weirdest thing. What does that have to do with purifying the Pokemon? Oh, okay. Oh, speaking of Cypher, Lily, have you made any progress with that data ROM we, we brought back from Cypher's lab? Oh yeah, I've asked Dex to analyze the contents of that SD card. It should really be, it should be soon ready soon. If I could read, that would help. Fat Yosh, that's right. My guy's name is Fat Yosh. If you don't know why, because that guy, that homie there, he's Fat Yosh. He's just my boy, and he's he's in this game. Fat Yosh, could you go upstairs and ask Dex how he's doing? Dex is the man in the room next to the director's office, remember? He was, yeah, okay, we know. Compiling basic data. That's so generic. Big Brother's tired, so Jovi will go. Oh, Jovi, it's okay. This is for work. Jovi's the worst. I mean, I don't hate Jovi. Because she's my sister. You, you, you know, I love my sister. Seeing Jovi and her boundless energy makes me realize I'm back home. Anyway, I wonder what's on that SD card. Oh, Jovi, there's no stopping. Jovi's already gone. Please fight Yoshi. Go get, okay. Yeah. Okay, well, yeah, this game flip-flops between, like, a forced weird widescreen and, like, an acceptable resolution. Don't worry about that. You're not going to throw up. Okay, we're back to... Now it's sort of Fat Yosh mode, I guess. Whenever it... Oh, okay. It, it really only does that in this area here. Is he's the... Oh, yeah, this is Dex, right? He's entering basic data. Okay, but while we're Shadow Pokemon, we made several interesting discoveries. They relate to a condition we call the Rage Mode of Shadow Pokemon. Would you like to hear about it? Sure. A shadow Pokemon will occasionally go out of control if its emotions run wild. That's what we refer to as rage mode. When a shadow Pokemon is undergoing purification, its heart slowly opens as it gradually prepares to return to its natural state. However, its shadowy aura doesn't go away until purification is complete. The shadow Pokemon sometimes snaps under its influence. That's why shadow Pokemon is more apt to go into rage mode the closer it is to full purification. It's quite ironic. When a shadow Pokemon is in rage mode, it will take damage from its own attacks and it won't accept any item except a cologne scent, which is so weird. You have to like, like, woo your Pokemon with like, Chanel number five. For that reason, if a Pokemon goes into rage mode, make it come to its senses by calling it or giving it a cologne massage. That's again, super weird. One last thing is Shadow Pokemon can't come out of rage mode on its own. That's why you've got to look after it. All right, you are definitely not Dex. I got bamboozled. Where's the data entry clerk? Ain't you, you're not. You're just standing at a table. You must be on break. Maybe he's over here. There seems to be a door. 
So this is like the 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 boss's office. Oh, Jovi. Oh, Dex is the man who's always fooling around in his computer here. This is strange. Jovi wonders where he went. Well, let's go find out. It's not him. He was lying under the table before hiding from Jovi. I would too. Uh, let's see what he says again. Seder. That's super weird. Yo, Kian. What's good, homie? What's good? Whoa, he says. Whoa! Okay, where are we at here? Where are we at, goddamn? Uh, so where is he supposed to be? Is this him on break, maybe? No, you're looking for Dex. Saw someone go outside earlier. Maybe that was Dex. Let's go check it out. Jovi says, I say, Jovi says, I say you're annoying, Jovi. Yes, thank you for so much. We're going to need a lot of, uh, actually, Mario, now that you're here, could you do exclamation mark say and something about Jovi? Be creative. I just want to see if it works. You're going to have to test this for the first time. How you doing, Kian, by the way? Super, super nice to have you. All right, where am I going, though? He said he leaves, but where does he go again? Oh, man, I should have really read that as opposed to just being enthralled by Jovi's ignorance. Okay, maybe this guy will tell me something. Unless that's him in the corner. Yo, he just went invisible. Oh, no, he's back. Welcome back. I knew it. Their hideout was in the southeast. So they were using the abandoned lab on the sly, were they? That's wickedly really clever of them. Yo, sup, Toast? What's good, homie? What you been up to? What are your gaming plans for the weekend? Says something, something, thumper farts. Oh my god, so freaking perfect. Perfect! He's got a little mouth and his head wobbles when he talks. <laughs> I'm so proud of myself. I'm so proud of myself. I saw someone go outside earlier. Maybe that was Dex. I mean, he just went outside. Pretty great. Thanks for asking. How about you? I'm actually doing okay now. I, I had to start playing games because I, I was fighting with a some automation to shiny hunt in Legends Arceus while uh, so while, while I was playing this, and it didn't work. And I hate it when I spend an hour and a half on something and it doesn't work. But here we are now. What's going on here? Oh, Bagon can be. <gasps> yeah, 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 yeah. I want Bagel, Bagel Boy with the uh, with the Jerry curl. So those guys just purify as I run around. That's nice. I thought I had to. I thought it was more time than that. Maybe it's maybe it's step count. It's probably step count. All right, Jovi, just to let you know. Dex went outside. Cool, 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 cool. Go make yourself a sandwich. You don't really have a job here. You're just a little baby girl. And let's go get back on. Ah, uh, yeah. There it is. Oh, is that what the hell? Is that chugging beer or cans of milk? Imagine cans of milk. Oh crap, that's disgusting. Canned milk. Is that a thing? I mean, we have bagged milk, so like, whatever, right? Switch. No. Switch. No. Switch. No. Switch. Wait, where the hell is he? He said Bagon can now be purified, but where the hell is he for me to purify him? Switch. What about this? Switch. So what if I put him in here? Does that auto purify him? Oh yeah, this is super complicated. Uh, uh, party maybe? Both. Ugh. Oh yeah, okay. So if I mu- mu- What am I doing? This is not what I have to do, isn't it? There it is. Place. This Bagon is ready to open its heart. However, there must be at least one regular Pokemon in the set to perform a purification. Oh my god, so annoying. Yeah, okay, cool. Uh, yeah, we're going to keep going. Because I'm going to go yoink. Can I yoink one of these homies? Give me this. Move. Uh, yeah, okay. <coughs> Place. Does it eat him, though? Uh, continue set edits? No. There's the Pokemon that is ready to open its heart. So what happens now? Oh, cool. Do I have to do anything? Do I have to dance? Oh, I just pressed A. Eh, ah, alright. Vite, I'm at work, but I'm totally lurking. I love you for it. I freaking love you for it. So much so. Ah, uh, we've got a clean bag on. I wonder if he levels up in this one, because the other one, they sort of level up. They gain XP. Okay, they, it did. That's the international... Oh, it loon, learned, like, was that Flare Blast? Scary Face, that's good. And now, for sure, it levels up. That's like a ton of XP. 24. There's no way that's an Evo level. What, what did I get? Ribbon. Nice. Uh, should I give a nickname to Jerry Curl? We'll call him Jerry Curl. He's got Jerry Curl. He's he's bordering on... on... We'll call him Jerry. Yeah, just Jerry. 
Jerry's pretty good. Actually, is that is it a J or a, a G? Wait, I don't want to. I don't want to be. Uh, hold on a second. I I don't want to. Oh my God, that's not even how you spell it. Spell it at all. The Jerry curl is. Oh, it could be written this way, but it's J H E R I apparently on Wikipedia or J E R I. So I'm gonna spell it this way, just because it makes me think of Jerry Seinfeld as well, and that just makes me makes me smile. Okay, uh, transfer to PC, the story, okay. Hey, wait a second. Can I access my PC from this? Oh, it's right up there. Let's go. Yeah, but he was right in my party before. Why wouldn't they just, anyway. I don't know what the Z button is. Oh, I do know what the Z button is. That's not, okay. All right. So now we basically have the party that I sort of want to use for the whole game, except for this guy. I don't like chicken, man. I just don't like him. I don't like a karate chicken. Yeah, I don't, it's weird how they... They ask you to leave, so the confirmation is saying no. You want to continue box operations, you have to say no. Which is... You know, whatever. <laughs> it's not a big deal. <clears throat> and plus, the, the, the buttons are... Well, they're not backwards, but that's sort of the curse of playing on multiple consoles. The A and B... Okay, what do you got to say? Anything else? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So we don't know where he went. He left... The town. And this is like some classic Nintendo 64 era RPGs. They're just like, eh, go check it out. Where where do you go? Do you have any any other hints than outside? No. Nah. All right. Well, thanks. What about you? You got any hints for us? But this guy, I saw Dex trudging outside the lab with a forlorn expression on his face. There's something the matter. Yeah, but like. Yeah, but yeah, but like. Forlorn expression isn't a location. What about you? Do you see Dex? Wow, Fat Yosh, I heard, I heard. You've done amazing things putting even grown-ups to shame. Might become your fan. If I'm ever kidnapped, promise me that you'll come save me. Giggle. Okay, I'm a kid. What, well, maybe Mom will have something to say. Could you go upstairs? Yep, yeah, he's not upstairs. You're ridiculous. Anyway, okay, so he left. We don't know where he left. Something about Forlorn. You know what? The only sort of depressio place in this whole area is the... Um... Oh, actually, maybe he's down here. Is this him? He looks pretty forlorn. Oh, it's Dex! Wow, I'm sorry, Professor. I couldn't... He called me Professor. I couldn't decipher it. Huh? Oh, it's you, Fat Yosh. All right. You scared me half to death. That SD card is heavily protected like a bank fault. It would take a seriously talented guy to break through and get at the contents. A seriously talented guy, you say? Crane. <gasps> That's a seriously talented guy. Wow, Professor. I'm terribly sorry. Aha, I can't be helped. And if it's a serious talented guy we need... Well, I think I have a solution. What the hell is that? Got you up on the co work computer? Oh my god, is that your actual work computer? <laughs> That's so good. I, <laughs> I'm on, <laughs> I'm on the IBM. Uh, I was gonna say IBM ThinkPad. That's like, that's so awesome. <laughs> Who's that jerk on the work computer? It's a vitamin. <laughs> I love that. Thank you so much, Corn Dog. <laughs> also, shame on you for being in light mode, but you know, we can't all be perfect, you know. <laughs> Not like Crane or Fat Yosh, rather. Fat Yosh is perfect. ONBS is known as a TV network, and they're much more than that. The people that later founded ONBS were actually instrumental in breaking Cypher's conspiracy five years ago. Please deliver that SD card to the net. To net. Okay, I don't BS. The right hand man, it's sex. ONBS. Ah, that's S E C C. All right, guys. Not getting canceled. I'm confident that he will be able to get all the contents of that SD card. Okay, let's go. So this game is mostly battling. Oh, there it is. Crane, Pyrite is, pa is past a gate. It's quite far. Cool. Cool. I'm definitely not logging in on that computer. Definitely not. Oh, that's just like a generic account. Gotcha. Okay, you're forgiven for the uh, for the light mode. Uh, the light mode Twitch. Me back. Had to restart the computer. Nice. I have a question. Was that the first time you restarted your computer in 500 years? 400 maybe? So Toasty? You've been brushing up on sports and or practicing the Kirby speedrun <laughs> or any other game that we could co-op <laughs> for speedruns. We need to be the co-op champs of speedrunnery, dude, which is probably not. Wow. This is this gives me some serious Final Fantasy seven vibes. Wall market. Mm. Mm. Wait for me. The hell's going on here? That's a weird set of clothes. All right, gasp. Mary, wait, wait for me. Yeah, uh -huh. you have to chase after. What the hell's going on with those cables? I don't usually have these many cables. Goddamn. Okay, let's go. 
Okay, what are you up? There goes Mary tearing off like a tornado as usual. There's one busy girl, huh? What's up with you? Why are you giving me the eye like that kid? Do you know who I am? I'm Kale. They call me the gatekeeper of Pyrite. <laughs> that smaller look says you're going to challenge me. Yeah, let's fight. All right, then I'll show you what being Kale, the gatekeeper of Pyrite's all about. All right. So this is definitely some Final Fantasy VII vibes. So not having played the original, actually having played the original, it would have been kind of really cool to be like, oh, what are they sending out? Nuzleaf and Sneasel? That's cool. That Sneasel looks almost identical to the PLA version, like the eyeballs, that is. I can probably do the curb speed run in a few weeks since I have four weeks left of my education. Nice. You get educated, son. Get educated hard, like hard education. Uh, these guys are both. I mean, in, so far in this game, anything that I thought was a special attacker is not. So, like, whatever. Uh, he needs a new fire move. But in the meantime, aerial, aerial ace is pretty dope. Let's do smash Nuzleaf out here. Fake out? <clears throat> That's fine. That's fine. That's a round one. So, Umbreon is Donkbreon because it sort of has a much likeness to a donkey. Low kick. Super effective. It's fine. The animations are oddly well the shadows are out of control today though but they're oddly good oh man it missed hyper voice what the hell how did it miss both oh no it it flinched my bad because of a fake out okay shout let's just do the exact same thing uh yeah why not worst case <clears throat> worst case hyper voice will finish him off smacko oh by the way in a couple weeks is uh there's two things coming out there's diablo I mean, at the time of, of today, anyway, there's the Diablo uh, mobile game and PC because they couldn't do it. Otherwise, they're going to get shut down for sure. And um, Mario Strikers. Oh, man, there's a new uh, I, I just watched the trailer and holy hell am I three. Yeah, there you go. There you go with 20 second chat delay and you nailed it, dude. Mario Strikers looks like a lot of fun at the moment. So far, it's it's got me excited. The the co-op or well, the co-op that yeah, the team play on it is more than I expected. Much more. Definitely going to be Pog. Definitely going to be some Poggers. But no Daisy. Not yet. Not yet. They've got plans for Daisy. Don't you Don't you worry about it. Okay, so <clears throat> let's... Um, we're going to light screen up because this is going to get kind of gross here. And let's just bulk up because I'm super fast anyhow. So I may as well get super strong while we light screen so we can just sweep as hard as we can. Knock off. I don't think my guys are holding any items. I mean, maybe that's something I should take a look. Oh, yeah, muscle band. That's unfortunate. That's not a big deal. It won't be a big deal. Yeah, so Daisy's not in strikers. I think we need to, what the hell, sign a petition. Yeah, that would have been nice to have before. But this is the world we live in now, so. Special defense a little. Speed boost act activated. Now we just have to crush, so... You know what? I think that Murkrow's the one hurting the most here, but Sneasel's kind of being a butt. So let's just do the thing here. I think we can punch Sneasel in the face. <clears throat> Low sweep it just for one last hurrah. That was very good. Later, Sneasel. And that means we're going to get to use Dark on Murkrow. What else is it going to bring out, though? Nice. Level up for Donk. Yeah, but... Oh, Toasty. You saw... Oh, Keen with the Prime! Thank you, Keen, for that. That's one out of 13 for the next Nintendo Switch Sports giveaway. We're actually currently giving one away right now. The timer's on screen. Enjoy. Uh, on screen. On screen. It's currently up. So, exclamation mark raffle. Thank you so much for the Prime, Keen. You rock. Mmm. 226 minutes to find my Twitch password. What? What? You're killing me. I'm happy you did, obviously. And, uh... <laughs> write that crap down somewhere, dude. <laughs> You're killing me. All right, we're just gonna... We're gonna have to stab. I mean, it doesn't... Yeah. That's... Yeah, that's fine. There's a weird, um... Predisposition to fight the Pokemon in my first slot. I don't know what that's about. That being said... They did almost murder Combuskin in one shot. Hyper Voice is alright. I really... I need something to bulk up. 
Actually, no, it's fine. It's going to be good for catching things. I'll, that's why I'll keep it. But the game still looks fun, even without Daisy in with the classic Strikers crew. Yeah, yo, Donkey Kong looks off the hook in Mario Strikers, by the way. Like, straight up looks like a maniac. I love it. That's not that's not so strong, is it? Oof, his uh, his moves are not where I need them to be right now. So let's start slamming at Houndoer. I have like six passwords of the same thing, but with different capital letters and different numbers at the end. <laughs> I feel you, 100%. I feel you. If someone finds my passwords, they're getting into all my stuff. <laughs> Full disclosure. Enjoy. Yeah, we're good. Okay, we can finish this fight. We're fine. Flinched. Oh, that's inconvenient. I was really banking on that. Yo, this Marsh Tomp looks so weird. He looks very, very weird. His eyeballs, I will never get over it. It's been a week since I've played this, and there are a few key points that stuck to in, in mind. One of them is Marsh Tomp looks like a total creep. <laughs> and Umbreon, uh, um, yeah, Umbreon's color scheme is absolutely amazing. The fact that it glows is just the coolest damn thing. Air slosh. Yeah, that's going to be it. I think that's it. No, it's eight. Eight a hit. <clears throat> Why did I double that? 16. Well, at least I didn't. Uh, it, see, that's what I needed last round. And the fight would have been over. That's fine. We're good now. All right. Everyone's leveled up except for Combuskin. And I don't think there's full party XP share. I think it's really only who's in the party. Wow, that guy broke his back. Yeah, the guys are the guys. Everyone's so dramatic when they lose a fight. Well, rightfully so. If you lost 720 bucks to like a child. Yeah. Hey, kid, I have to hand it to you. You have to be good to beat Kale. Pirates. Okay, that's it. You're just going to reiterate. What is this? There's like an icon at the top. It's like a smiley face. Hmm. 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 What's going on here? Have you heard wild Pokemon have appeared? Jenny, who's considered Pyrite's mother, foretold the appearance of Pokemon in the wild. Well, it came true. It's incredible. We'll now be able to catch wild Pokemon right here in Or region. Cool. Who's this? This lady looks insane. Find what you seek. Be it an object, person, or luck. Welcome to Jenny's fortune telling chamber. I'm Jenny. If ever a problem clouds your brow, you shall come to me. Mr. Duking, this town's leader, told my fortune telling. Yo, congrats. You just leveled up, homie. That's what you get for participating. Oh, is that Streamlabs? Oh, sorry about that. I'm not, I'm not. <laughs> I need to find a way to actually kill the bots progressions in this thing. It doesn't matter. How you doing, Gerb? Welcome, welcome, welcome. You keep hitting those shinies. Do, do, do it for me, dude. And at some point, I'll figure out a way to do it on stream. I, I have an idea. Using another capture card that, that period, that I can capture in two places. Or doing it on maybe my PC that I'm not using and uh, and then, you know, NDIing it over. That could be cool. Look at these dudes on the wall, though. Are those characters from Coliseum? That dude with the crazy eyebrows and mustache has to be a Coliseum character. Let's see if this one runs away, too. Speaking of that, I have one waiting for me now. Oh, my God. That's so cool. Lots of them will go out of their way to pick a fight with you. Be, be careful out in the streets. All right. So the dude on the wall back here has got like a mustache for days. What's back here? Is this like the prison? Hey, what's up, buddy? Darn it. Got locked up over a dumb street fight. Don't get it here soon. Huh? Kid, are you? That thing on your arm. It can't be. Ah, oh, no, it's nothing. I lost already. This guy's got to be a dude from the first game. Like, so it's, it's just lost on me. TM54. I don't know what this Gen's TM orders are. I, I started memorizing in, in Gen 5, and then here we are. Um, Stomping Tantrum. This user attacks driven by rage. That's kind of cool. So these guys got to be enemies from the first game. Oh, wow, wow, I got lumps in my head from the shiny heading. Guy thumping me. I don't deny. I lipped off at him first. He took swing at me. You got to let, let me out of here. Yo, that's what you get, dude. Fighting is not the answer. Peace and love, homies. Peace and love. So what is it, Grub? What's the shiny? Okay, you look sketchy. I just need to heal my group. Oh, I guess not. Oh, color. They're walking perfectly in sync. All right, then. What have we here? Well, if it isn't trudely and folly... What do you think you're up to? It's literally Cloud Strife. What the hell? Or two Albe Albeed from uh, Final Fantasy X. You've got it all wrong. We're here to do, do some shopping. That's all. Now, don't you lie to me. I know you. I know the likes of you. You're up to no good, aren't you? Oh, Umbri's here. Umbri, I I don't think you guys have switched ports, so that would be so dope. 
I wish everybody wins all the time. Cut us some slack, Officer Johnson, sir. We've had a change of heart. We've sworn off our criminal ways. Yes, sir. Wow, that's weird. No, 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 no. That doesn't wash with me. No, sir, it doesn't. I won't have you lot walking around the streets as if you own the place. Oh, Flareon. Nice. There it is. I've been watching. Nice. Shiny Bronzong. No, exactly what I was looking for, but I'll take it. Yo, I think Bronzong is the most common shiny in PLA. Someone on the internet, correct me if I'm wrong. Pompous Oaf. Follow the man who won't listen to reason. Let's get out of here. Yeah, I don't know why it keeps flip-flopping between a weird widescreen, not widescreen. I don't, I don't know what the odd mechanic is for that. Okay, I need to find a... Is this C for center, as in Pokemon Center? Negative. You gonna fight me? I'm Carl, the operating manager of Pirate Coliseum. My manager and title only. Just filling in. Duke the town's leader discovered... A place where wild Pokemon gather. Ever since then, he's been engrossed in searching for wild Pokemon. In the meantime, he left me in charge of the Coliseum. If you want to battle, you should go straight to the Coliseum registration desk and apply. I'm just sick at home, so lurking. Yeah, I read that, dude. You're sick. Are, are you, like, cold flu sick or, like, stomach puking pooping sick? If you, oh, man. Either way, it sucks. I hope you get better, and you know it's all about rest, right? Jesus. And it makes sense. You've been working so damn hard. At some point, the body just can't hold up anymore. At least, you know, I, I hope it's not like a deadly sick. So, like, if you rest up, you'll be good. But at least you know how hard you've been working. This is how hard you've been working. How how sick you get is how hard you've been pushing it. That's it. The, the word of vitamin. This is me doing a... I don't know what I just did. Like a cross? I don't know. But it's a bit too dark and chilly for me. Old bones sake. Cool. What's this all about? Any any of you hidden items in this? Like if you press A on a wall, then all of a sudden you get all kinds of cool stuff. All right, this place was a was a bonk. I need a Pokemon Center. I mean, take care of them. Of course you have. Wifey for lifey. Is this the Pokemon Center? Where, oh, this is just a shop though. Maybe maybe there's a healing station in the Pokemon Center. This place looks too run down. For sure, there's no healing. Oh my god, all these guys are gonna fight me, aren't they? Okay, full heal, something or other. Listen, I'll give you 10 Pokeball Poke Poles for free? Yeah. Yes, of course you would. Anyone to make that mistake and accept. The hell? Should I buy today? X accuracy? Yo, I never purchased that crap in my life. Anyone here actually buy X accuracy stuff in games? Oh my god. Dire hit? Get out of here. As we told me to go for exactly these. <clears throat> oh, what the hell? Okay, what do you gotta sell? Super potions, revives, great balls. How many do I have? I have none. Uh, let's get five, because it's a good number. Cool. Five's good. Go back to trying the Growlithe, and then we'll see what we can do. Getting your setup working better. Oh, homie. Lots of water. That's definitely the way to go. Maybe some bone broth, because it's easy to get down. Um, headache, body ache, sore throat. It'll be okay, though. Just work. Going to work. Wouldn't help. Of course not. I've never played this game. It does seem fun. Never. Never! So, yeah, like, who the hell would buy an Accuracy? Right? Like, or any of that stuff. I, You know, okay, I have the answer to it. The people who do speedruns and, like, min-max, oh, that's definitely a, a fight. I, I mean, people who do speedruns, no. So they're like, okay, I, I specifically need, like, an extra, like, attack up to be able to get this with my 10 level under dude. Like, I've seen that for sure. But anyone else? I'll go find it. I'll run to the end of a hall and have, like, 75 random encounters along the way and pick up, like, an item I'll never use. Don't get me wrong. But I won't use it. And I have never played this, but the actual RPG element to it is pretty big. Um, and as much as there's dialogue as any proper RPG... Oh man, this is going to be a really annoying fight. Um, I need physical attack the crap out of Blissey. I think they both physical attack, but in, in, the, in the event that someone moonbeams me, I better just go... Oh man, no fizzies. No fizzies here, god darn. You know what? Screw it. Let's just start smacking Clefable because it's going to be the biggest problem. Yeah, so the game is pretty dope and they get you into the action. Now, obviously, this is rendered on like a 2000 something, you know, plus um, year PC. So the effects, the animation effects are really, really good. Well, I was literally typing the same thing you said. I will collect everything, but never use them. Yep. You want to know why you're typing that? Because that's literally real gamers like i i defy anyone that's not true so, some people are very meticulous about mathing 
I'm in this for a good time. <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm in this for a good time. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, people, I, maybe if I, okay, so my IVs, it's seven. And if my attack rating's 23, if I, okay, so uh, maybe if I go against Bliss, who's got a defense rating. And if I, if I use, uh, maybe if I consider using uh, an attack up and uh, maybe I go over to Viridian uh, Forest and Celadon's, uh, nope. No, I'm not doing that. I'm not gonna, I'm not, I choose not to live my life that way. Yo, do I not have a, like a physical attacker on my team? This is the worst. The worst. I also feel that they're just gonna wreck me. So let's, let's like crush. Oh, it's my boy Vasco. I made him. He's a robot that lives in Portugal. Last stream, I got a timeout. I think you had a timeout for posting a link. I don't think we timed you out just for being a human. Maybe. It's possible. I have that. We have done that before. But I just know Vasco is a robot that lives in, in, uh, yo, why did he attack this guy? That's not who I chose to attack. Anyway, Va because I, oh, okay. So Friday nights are pizza nights in pizza. We trust in pepperoni. We trust. Amen. Um, anyone who defies this is, is yeah, you're, you're going to, you're going to jail. Yeah. Jade, Jade got timed out for being Jade. Let's be honest. But that being said, Vasco didn't eat pizza last Friday, and we all know what happens then. Big trouble. Oh, crap. I forgot to turn on our channel point redeems. Jesus. Totally forgot. Let's turn them all back on. Donk, donk, donk. Wish me luck. Ex summon Yoshi. Stretch. Cade. We have to, I'll turn them all on. I'll even turn on Dracerins, and that's like the one that crashes out my software. They're all coming in hot, guys. I don't know if you're gonna get like, you might have to refresh, but we'll we'll get them soon enough. I'm just turning on every single channel point redeem, and that's about 30, I think, or 28. That's 12, good. Summon Toad. Let's do it, let's do it. That's good. Wow. And yes, kill switch included. Oh, why didn't it work? Oh, I know why it didn't work. I know, I know why it didn't work. I think that that one's like still bound to touch portal. We'll we'll do it manually. I think I can do it manually. I actually have to launch touch portal. Um, where is it? Grab. Let's see, We're about to figure it out. Oh my god. Okay, so far so good. Well, I'm just on science here. So far, so far, so good. We haven't crashed out the stream. I've got a beautiful, beautiful singing voice. Could you confirm that the voice is still going through? It should still be going through. There's no reason why it wouldn't. I'm just doing drugs. Don't you worry about it. It's it's just drugs. It's okay. It's okay. It's just drugs. It's okay. Ah, <laughs> uh, voice is going. I, you got science. <laughs> That's so funny. All right, now we get to start blasting here. Uh, Fampy, you know what, Play Rough is gonna be the way to go. Is Fairy on Fairy weak? I think Fairy on Fairy's weak. I need to take out a Gen 7 type chart. Gen 7 type chart. Let's take a look at you. There it is. That's what I needed in my life. Open that up. What the hell? I said open that up. No. There it is. Open that. There it is, perfect. Uh, it doesn't have fairy on it. There it is. Uh, no, it doesn't. Wow, that's so annoying. What the hell? It's just drugs. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Thank you. Get out of here. Gen 7 type chart. Why is there no fairy? When the hell was Gen S was fairy introduced? Man. Science, am I right, ladies? Yes. Yeah. They know it. The ladies know. Yes. Yeah. Well, I mean, yeah, we've been through this already. Please. Gen 6 fairy was added. That's what I thought. So for sure Gen 7 had it. All right. Regain health. I don't care about anything that you're peddling right now. All right, good. Now we got rid of <clears throat> Clefairy, which was my... Go, Jerry! It's Jerry. It's so funny that his name is Jerry. The thing is, later on, he's not going to look anything like that. Just doing drugs. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. There's so many fairy trainers in this game, it's insane. 
Uh, and yet, I have no idea how to track that and, and why... You know what? You want to know my, my biggest issue right now is that I'm using Microsoft Bing. Yes, I said that properly. Microsoft. Uh, let's just blast it. I don't have any steel or poison. Are you kidding me right now? Well, whatever. I guess it doesn't really matter. All right. So let's... Uh, Durgan's weak. Uh, it's just going to kill me, though. I, I'm not too nervous about anyone else. I'm just kind of terrified... T kind of terrified of uh, that of Azumaro. Squirtle, squirtle. Um, we're gonna have to probably just scary face it. Jesus. You know what? We'll just do this here. Yo, mediocre me. How the hell you doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome, 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 welcome. Very nice, very nice seeing you. And um, and uh, as much as 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 we love our indie games, I suppose this counts as an indie game now. It's like a three thousand year old game. Welcome. Well, you're awake. You wrote earlier that you already ordered pizza. Did you pass out after eating an early pizza? What the hell? Hey, plain face. Call him plain face now. That's terrible. Oh, this is going to suck. Yeah, I'm quad weak. No, I'm not quad weak. Both my dudes. Uh, we're fine. We're, this is fine. Everything's fine. I've got nothing to take care of as Azumaro. Like nothing. And I don't think I can actually out-muscle this, so we're just gonna have to... Wow, this sucks. Oh. I mean, I've lost fights before in this, so it's not the end of the world. And plus, like, half my team was already dead going into this. I mean, I'd pass out after eating pizza. Yeah. Yeah. The only thing is, it's supposed to be pizza night, not pizza, like, noon. I didn't pass out. Handling that thing right now, I'll be less lurky after that. But you just wake up, or what? I don't understand, Zaltaxi. And you're just, you're just out of control now, dude. You're eating pizza in the day. Jesus. Okay, let me just yell at this thing for a little bit. Pizza night, dude, not pizza day. Yeah, so we're giving away currently, raffling off, rather, a copy of Nintendo Switch Sports. If you enjoy the Sprots, enter the raffle. And I'm playing a, a gen of Pokemon that I haven't played ever. Uh, and it is a fan-based ROM hack, so basically not traditional. Now, where's the Pokemon Center? I guess it'll revive me at the closest. Oh, there. What the hell's going on with the sheets over here? What? What's under? Is there something under the sheets? Jovi will go on adventure with her big brother one day somewhere far, somewhere... Oh, where are Popo and... What the hell is going on here? What's going on in that bed? And I spoke to it and there's Jovi in there. Did I just sleep in there with my sister? I don't feel so good about that. I'm getting out of here. Let's just forget everything. Let's go fight dudes. Let's go fight dudes to forget. We fight to forget, huh? Questionable indeed. That was weird. Is Legends Arceus technically Gen 4? It is... Yeah. I think there's some move sets that aren't in either, so yeah. The actually no, because there's Pokemon from other gens in it, right? So it's not Gen 4. It's technically Gen uh, Gen 8. I think they call it Gen 9, to be honest. They've called it Gen 9 at this point. I believe. Uh, someone correct me if I'm wrong, but they didn't. They they've called it the next. Uh, the, look at this, 2022. Yo yo Wolf, what's good? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Been a little while. What you been up to? What you been playing? I'm just trying to fight with everybody in this town. Because that's the only way to get better, right? Break everyone else's legs. So they can't catch you. That's the trick. I vaguely remember playing this game. Vaguely? Oh my god, you're lucky to have played it. Like, it was just like an entire gen that like... I don't know. I don't know. It, it felt like it was just swept under the rug. I guess because it wasn't in the handheld console Pokemon games. So, okay, you're up now. Let's do this, dude. You, will you battle me again? Yes. Perfect. Let's battle. Yeah. Um, so this is the sequel to Pokemon Coliseum, which is weird because they went like, you know what I mean? Stadium 1, Stadium 2, Coliseum. Then they changed names on us, which is fine. Which is fine. <laughs> but I just, you know, just weren't expecting it. All right, I still don't have a steel or poison move. I don't even, I mean, I would imagine uh, Elephant Man's going to have the steel or poison move. Oh, this is going to suck. Uh, we're not going to get a chance to bulk up or do anything here. Um, I think we're just going to have to aerial ace the crap out of Azumaro. Wow, this is going to suck. Yeah, 
I'm 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 happy to be able to try out this game now and now with the extra rendering on the PCs it's just super beautiful super beautiful mm. slice okay waterfall this is gonna suck this was gen 3 area I wasn't a fan of that gen so yeah I totally missed gen 3 this is actually one of those more unique games in the franchise it a hundred percent like 100 percent yo I just real okay yeah we're sending out grassman a hundred percent this is one of the all these sort of 3d games in the franchises theoretically are, are just better and then for whatever reason they just decided not to not to keep on that vibe until about you know swish sword and shield didn't play many of the Pokemon games mostly Zelda and Mario yes Pokemon always intimidated me as a kid because strats oh my god for real no, <laughs> no I I play Pokemon like uh like just not not like a pro gamer just like a like a video game stand it's an it's like an RPG to me I guess right just with like too many freaking characters but normally there aren't many strats this gen is particularly difficult uh not I mean yes and they also made it extra difficult like they, they did it on purpose to make it the suck but this is a fan-made game so it's not the same experience my Roomba ate my charger what the hell you know it doesn't actually have teeth though like it's still good <laughs> raffle I uh, see just don't worry about competitive stuff just play Pokemon casually oh yeah the, the main games aren't that difficult in Pokemon period if you you have to make them difficult by doing like sort of like no death challenges like called, called nuzlocks i don't know if you're aware what that what that is but anyway i don't want to like patronize anyone that knows already but it just basically means that if a pokemon faints you can never use it again it's as though it died and that that makes things much trickier but other than that yeah younger me yeah yeah my brother made everything competitive okay so that's the issue you had like a poor partner <laughs> I get it. So it just used ice, so I feel Marsh Tom's the only thing I can I can whip out on this. <clears throat> yeah, otherwise who cares? Yeah, but Zelda and Mario for real though. At this point, I don't think so. My one of my favorite streaming um, happenings ever was a 24-hour stream for the Mario 3D All Stars, where it was a fundraiser, and every single time I lost a life, I donated a dollar. So I ended up donating a lot of dollars because over 24 hours you start making mistakes. So I did eight hours of Mario 64, eight hours of S Sunshine, and then eight hours of Galaxy. And believe me, when you're flopping around in 3D in Galaxy, you start making a lot of mistakes. And uh, but, you know, no worries. I just donated more money. It was kind of freaking awesome. Freak. So, yeah, that was a lot of fun. <clears throat> but Mario games are I, I have, a, I have a, a weakness for for the Mario games, for sure. I'm not like good. at. I mean, I'm good enough. But... You know. Sup, Game Bandit? What's good? What's good? What's good? What's good? I've been busy for for graduating and not getting much lurk in getting game jobs. So I've been... Bu wow, there's no punctuation. Whew, let's do this punctuationless. I've been busy for graduating and not getting much luck in getting game jobs. So I've been busy, but I am back now. Perfect. There it is. We did it. We got through it without punctuation. Well, if they're asking you to write, you know, proper grammar for these applications, then I'll help you out. I'm pretty good at grammar. It's the only it's one of the only things I'm I can say that I'm actually good at. <clears throat> not like not like video games. Not not good at video games. But that being said, Star Wolf, um that sucks and I don't know where you live for like industry of gaming and stuff like that game development mobile or otherwise um and i don't know if you're being like difficult or picky but i hope that you land the job of your dreams or at least the stepping stone job of your dreams because i know you're very creative and you've got a, a very very smart mind and you can do it 100 percent. and now they wonder why i'm a competitive person yeah no kidding no kidding you, you get a bro that just like crushes you all the time i mean i think i did that to my sister to be honest yeah, now that I think of it, I probably ruined her gaming experiences to the max. Actually, it's not true. She's she still plays games, uh, but like she'll still play like like Super Nintendo games. Like she's got that uh, 
the Super NES sort of like whatever 20 in one emulator garbage thing there. And uh, it's it's cool, but it's it is whatever, whatever, whatever. And <laughs> and uh, and she's pretty good. Like she'll crush Super Mario World like with the best of them. I should have her over and we should play Super Mario World like she'll just carry me. She's for whatever reason. She just masters that game actually. And that would be how I would do it. I would do the crowdfunding. What the hell's going on here? Oh, that sucks. I hate that so much. Back Moonblast. I went the other way. I actively work against teams most of the time. That's true. Whenever Zalta actually and I play games, it's five times harder than when I play them alone. And my back hurts. Like, oh, I don't know, man. Maybe it's because that that session last night. I really hurt my back carrying him. It's, oh, it's so rough. It's really hard. When we poop in our pants in Faz again? Yeah, that's the other thing. Phasmophobia is the one experience where I can't do anything alone. I will gladly accompany you to our certain doom, but having to go in and do stuff alone, like, I'm sorry, but I need an adult diaper. Game Bandit's doing good. Trying to complete the next set of stuff in Switch ports. Yeah, totally. I'll be taking care of that bit later. I think I, I started, like, I got one or two items from it. I'll take care of that later. That, that'll make for some fun content. Bowling and, and the likes. Bowling like no one has ever known. This man, he thinks he does the carrying. Well, I mean, my my back's the one. I mean, my back's blasted. I'm just saying. Faz is so much fun. I'm so bad. I need holding hands always. Okay. So here's the thing. Absolutely. And Phasmophobia is best played with people that don't know what the hell they're doing as well. And not to the point that we can't finish the game, but like more like it, it's, it's best played with people that are sort of lost and experiencing it for the first-ish time as well um or people that are <laughs> enjoy people that enjoy the experience of you being blasted <laughs> by this thing and what i mean is some people just like to watch the world burn <laughs> i want to play the game for fun and not for the fast win grub too high tier for for faz he's out oh no nah, no no one's out it's more like just understand that like i'm i think i'm dying at any given moment and that's and for whatever reason that's why i'm here i'm here for the death feeling i don't know why i just started it all i've seen gameplay and know the gist but i turn into a very soft bean so here's the thing mediocre we only have ever played phasmophobia though in vert in vr so our experience of phasmophobia is exclusive to virtual reality that's how that's how we've always played it uh, at least okay so i get to sit down that's what that means so yeah yeah so we played in the quest so with the quest 2 headset just being like a standalone is kind of freaking awesome for vr why did my mask come off well i'm gonna fix this after so yeah it's really the best experience because then like when you hear like a dangus next to you it's like right there and you hear the little heartbeats, it's like right in your... Ah, it's so terrible. It's the worst. Actually, me mediocre is 100% right. Heck nah. It's literally, legitimately the absolute worst. It's the worst thing in the entire world. Don't don't get me wrong. I don't think anyone should ever have to go through it. But I'll, I, I love to do it. I don't love to do it. I hate doing it. The, we're talking about it now, but I, I hate it. I don't know why we do this. It's because it's funny. And uh, I appreciate the, uh, I don't know. I, I think it's because it's funny. Phasmo's fun, but only in, I, I, I don't know. Pancaking Phasmo, I guess it's, okay. So maybe if you have no choice, playing it on PC is interesting. But if you've ever played it in VR, it's just a whole other monster. And not even worth comparing anymore. You know what I mean? Like in the sense that, like, not that you can't go back, but it's just not the same game. Why would you ever, like, you can't, like, why would you ever play it, like, on a flat screen? I guess because you're tired, but it's not the same. It's the screen's there, like, whatever. I guess with headphones, it'd be, like, a better experience. 